Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. <laughs> Today is November the 5th. It is Saturday. <laughs> uh, my days all meld together. Anyways, I got some finished objects. I want to hop on here and show, share with you guys. Uh, there is a crochet uh, blog, I guess, that is doing a all through November a like Advent countdown to the holiday season. <laughs> and so they're putting out cute little. Um, and my patterns every day and today's day five but i've done three of them so far uh and they're written in worsted weight yarn with a g-hook but i have been making them in i think size two yarn with a three millimeter hook and um yeah so mine are smaller i made them smaller on purpose to make up to use as ornaments was my plan so the the website is called five little monsters and i'll link it below in the description box so you can check it out but day one was a tree so I made a tree. And this yarn, I don't know what it is. It's just, the ball band just say yarnspirations.com. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure. So there's that, this little tree. It's made in two parts. The green part and the brown part are two separate parts and I sewed them together. The pattern does have a star, but I didn't want to put that on there. I just made a regular tree. And then day two was a snowman. I made the little snowman. He's got a tail, cause I was gonna make a hanger. I think his nose looks like a beak. I gotta, I'm gonna go back and try to fix his nose and make it look a little less like a beak. <laughs> but I think he's cute. He's got his little hat on uh, with a brim. And I made the scarf. I didn't make the scarf different. They made it in two parts, like a part that goes around and then a part that hangs down. I just made like a long chain and then single crocheted back. And then I just stitched it on there because I didn't want to make two separate parts uh, to do it. And his eyes are just uh, French knots. I didn't put little safety eyes in there. But there's a little snowman. And then day three was a sugar cookie, but I didn't have a, the right color yarn for the cookie part in that small yarn. So mine's a gingerbread cookie. <laughs> so I had to use a darker brown instead of like a tan. And then I made a uh, white and then I put the red and green sprinkles on it. So there's the three that I've made so far. Let's see here. Day four was, is an angel. And um, today's one was, I think a little teddy bear. So I'm gonna try to make all of them if I like them. I don't know if I'm gonna make the angel. If I make the angel, I'll have to make it all white or all one color, cause I don't have a good, any good skin colors. Um, and I guess I can use this, but I don't want to use so much of that. And the bear is gonna be brown too. I don't want most of them to be brown, you know. I want to be like a. But then again, there's probably gonna be a lot of white too. I don't know, maybe I'll make it yellow, <laughs> like a like it's glowing. But uh, so there's an angel and a teddy bear. <laughs> they also put out in between these a um little stocking gift card holder which is really cute so i might make that too <laughs> i don't know but i do have some people i'm giving gift cards to so i might make a couple of those to gift them in but with that i'll have to use the right the right size yarn or it'll come out too small for a gift card but that's what i was working on the last few days i am still working on my marie curry she's almost done but in between i've been working on little ornaments because they're so cute and i can work on pieces of them while doing one with the baby but I'll leave their links down below if you want to check them out. And all November, the same person is putting out more cute little patterns. So uh, head over there and check them out. And uh, yeah, so I'll leave the main website links below. And the direct links to these three patterns. <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and hop off here because she is uh, feisty. And I will see you guys in the video. Bye guys.